Hello out there, welcome to this tutorial on quadratic equations. In this video, we'll be looking at symmetric functions of roots of quadratic equations. So we start with our problem. Given that alpha and beta are the roots of the quadratic equation, x squared minus 8x minus 4 is equal to 0. Without finding the values of alpha and beta, find the value of a alpha squared plus beta squared b alpha q plus beta q c alpha minus beta and d alpha squared minus beta squared so we start with the solution of the problem um, in our solution we are going to find the sum and product of the roots where the sum is alpha plus beta and um, the product is alpha beta so we know initially that x squared minus the sum x plus product is equal to zero. So if this is compared with the original equation, we see that alpha plus beta is equal to eight and alpha beta, which is this alpha times beta is equal to negative four. So this is it here. So we then go ahead to use this information to evaluate the value of each of the following so we start with a alpha squared plus beta squared if it is factorized we are going to have it as alpha plus beta all squared minus 2 alpha beta so we then substitute the values of alpha plus beta and alpha beta here so substituting alpha plus beta and alpha beta we are going to have h squared minus 2 into negative 4 since this is 2 and alpha beta is negative 4 and this is giving us um, 8 plus 64 giving us 72 that gives alpha squared plus beta squared then we go to the b part of the problem alpha cube plus beta cube by expansion we are going to have alpha plus beta in bracket then block bracket alpha plus beta squared minus 3 alpha beta substituting alpha plus beta to be equal to 8 and alpha beta to be negative 4 we have 8 into 8 squared minus 3 into negative 4 input this in our calculator we are having 608 giving the value of alpha cube plus beta cube then we go to c part of the problem alpha minus beta alpha minus beta gives square root of alpha plus beta squared minus four alpha beta this is algebraic identities we need to have in our memory we then substitute alpha plus beta and alpha beta into this expression so we now have it as square root of h squared minus four into negative four this is giving us square root of 80 since this is 64 plus 16 giving us 80 and then simplifying root 80 we have it as 4 root 5 80 is 16 times 5 and square root of 16 is 4 then root 5 that's all for c we then go for d alpha squared minus beta squared this is difference of two squares giving us alpha plus beta into alpha minus beta fortunately we've gotten alpha minus beta to be 4 root 5 and then we have our alpha plus beta substituting we have 8 times 4 root 5 that is the value of alpha minus beta simplifying this we have 32 root 5 which gives the value of alpha squared minus beta squared and that's the end of solution to this problem and this is where we are ending this tutorial thank you for watching i hope you enjoyed it please like and share this video until we come your way again goodbye